canceled. Cincinnati was one of the cities that had a march. About a thousand people turned out this morning in downtown. Our demonstration took place at City Hall. Music from flutes made of gun barrels started the March for Our Lives movement in Cincinnati. A steady snow didn't dampen the spirits of the students and activists who gathered at City Hall. This movement is about gun control, yes, but it's also about students using their voices to advocate for themselves. And we will not be silent! Thousands chanted and held signs like this one saying no guns. The movement was led by local students. They were joined by Ethel Gutenberg, the grandmother of one of the Parkland shooting victims. Their speeches inspired a passionate crowd. I don't think either of us have ever spoken to a crowd so large, especially about an issue that we care so much. And it's incredible to see that like so many people came out even when it's freezing and it's snowing. The group then marched a one mile loop to and from City Hall. Their message, more needs to be done to keep schools safe. I feel unsafe at school every day I walk in and I, I have to think about where my potential exits are and I feel really uncomfortable. We shouldn't be talking about this at our schools nowadays, so we need to approach gun reform because our laws here are just unacceptable.